Hi, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm Sheena, I am the blogger behind Sheena in the City. I am going to do a YouTube video today with 20 facts about me. Um, I got the idea from another blogger who's also my friend, Katina Bobina. Uh, she did a 23 facts about her for her 23rd birthday and it was her first YouTube video. Um, and I thought it was just a really good way for her readers to get to know her and give personality to the voice behind the writing. Um, so I thought it would be a cool idea to do it on this channel, especially because I have some vlogs up here from a project I did last year and I feel like you guys don't really know much about me on YouTube and the people who read my blog. So I'm going to do 20 facts about me. This is probably a video I should have planned because I don't even know what facts I'm going to talk about, but I guess we'll see what happens. I've thought about it a little bit, um, but I'm probably going to get stuck somewhere along the way, but we'll see. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. So number one, I am half Pakistani and then my other half is a mix of Italian, Irish, um, and I'm not sure what else. Number two, I am a photographer or aspiring photographer. It's just a hobby of mine. I did minor in it in college um, and I loved doing film photography and my favorite form of photography was doing portraits, so I like taking pictures of people. Uh, number three, I have a dog and her name is Angel and I am obsessed with her and I am obsessed with every other dog I see on the street. <laughs> Number four, I am more of a TV show gal. Um, I feel like there are two types of people and or maybe I guess you could say three, the people who love TV shows and don't really watch movies as much, or the people who love movies and don't really get into the whole TV show thing, or I guess people who are kind of in the middle and like both. Um, I do watch movies, but I am more of a TV show buff. I love binge watching and just watching TV. Um, I would rather watch a TV show instead of putting on a movie. And I'm currently watching um, The West Wing on Netflix and the second season of Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. I should probably keep track of this. Um, otherwise, I will lose count. Um, number five, I have the biggest sweet tooth. Um, I don't think I've met anybody who has as big of a sweet tooth as I do. Which brings me to number six, which is I used to want to be a baker. Um, I wanted to open up a cupcake shop with one of my best friends and my oldest sister and we would just spend our summers while we were in school baking and practicing those baking skills. Um, and I guess it's still a dream one day, I don't know. Am I on five or am I on six? I, I really just lost count. Um, it's either number six or number seven. Um, but whatever number it is. I am actually on a paleo diet right now, um, which sounds pretty crazy. If you don't know what paleo is, it's basically a high protein diet, no dairy, no flour, wheat, rice, carbs, bread, um, and no uh, refined sugars. So no candy and chocolate, like I said, with my big sweet tooth thing. Um, you basically get all your sugar from fruits and yeah, I'll explain why, which is the next point. I am doing CrossFit. I signed up for the six week, six week program. It's called the New You program and it's basically a bunch of newbies to the CrossFit arena and it's an all women's class and it's really, really great. I've just been trying to find a really good workout routine for me and it's been hard and so I decided to just sign up for this and try it and it came with a whole diet plan and following this strict diet plan um, helps me be more efficient in the gym and put more energy towards the workout um, and just put things that can actually, I can actually digest in my body because I was having a lot of issues with just how I felt, um, tired all the time and 
Yeah, so I started CrossFit and along came the diet with that. Okay, so my last one about the CrossFit was actually number eight. I just made a list right now of everything I'm gonna talk about so I don't have long pauses and get confused about the numbers. Number nine, I think that's where we left off if I counted correctly. I am in a long-term relationship. I have uh, a boyfriend. We've been together for... Uh, I'm scared to tell you guys because people are always so... Like, they always have a different reaction, but um, we've been together for almost 11 years. Number 10, I work... Sorry, I keep looking down and I feel... Like, I should just know these things. Okay, I'm gonna put this over here so I stop looking down. Okay, number 10, I work in public relations, specifically in technology public relations. Number 11, I used to live in the city. Oh yeah, I live in Chicago, I should probably mention that. Um, but I used to live in the city um, for three years in college. I lived in a dorm uh, off the Chicago Red Line stop and I loved living in the city. I was, it was just my favorite to be living in the city and in that environment because I really love a fast-paced lifestyle. Um, which brings me to my next point which is number 12. I currently live in the suburbs. Um, I moved back in with my dad because I am saving money and I am a big thrift shopper. I love to just spend hours and hours in thrift stores. Um, if you saw my last haul, actually my first ever haul that's on this channel, it was a thrift store haul and the only thing I brought home was books and it's still the same. I still go to the thrift store and I always leave with at least one book. I used to play the clarinet. Um, it's kind of a little geeky and nerdy but um, you know when you're in elementary school and they tell you you have to pick an instrument uh, I actually really did want to go into orchestra but for some reason I chose band and for some reason I chose the clarinet no idea why like I, it, looking back at it that's like not my personality to choose the clarinet of all instruments um, but I did actually enjoy playing it and I was pretty good at it Number 15, um, I have grown to hate doing my nails. Um, you will almost always find my nails there because I don't like painting them. I'm very impatient. I hate sitting and waiting for them to dry. And even when I sit and wait for them to dry, I still end up with marks or dents or fingerprints all over my nails. Um, so I'd rather, I'd rather just file them and just make sure that they're at a decent length that I can handle. Okay, I, I think I'm on 15. Yeah, I even have a list and I'm still, I'm still confused. I'm always late. Um, I one time tweeted out that I am never gonna be that girl who will have her hair and makeup done fully like especially if I have to get somewhere in the morning it's usually I will take the time to do my makeup and my hair will just be a mess or it'll just be like whatever it is when I come out of the shower just because I don't I don't give myself enough time to get ready I, I'm just always waking up late or running out the door or trying to catch a train I'm I'm kind of a mess in terms of I guess you could say like prioritizing my life um, keeping my room clean, sticking to one thing. I'm, I think I get bored easily, so I'm always just like thinking of all these new ideas and plans that I can do, new blog posts, new videos, and I just move on to the next thing without finishing the first thing. So then I have all these things that are in progress and in process, and, I, and then I'm just like, I just go crazy because I have all these things that I have to get done and I can't prioritize correctly. Um, which actually if you if I were to show you my room right now you would see how much of a mess I am because I started before I started doing this video um, I started to uh, change out my wardrobe so putting away my winter clothes and bringing out my spring and summer clothes and I stopped 
halfway. Um, I waited until my 21st birthday to have my first drink. I traveled to Europe for the first time last summer. I went with my boyfriend. Um, I think we went for about two and a half weeks. We visited Dublin, um, then we went to Paris, and then we went to Madrid, and it was amazing. And actually, um, if you see this photo right here, I got this printed. I, I'm sure it's blurry, but um, there's a photo right here. I got a whole bunch of these photos printed um, from this thing, and I actually... I have them sitting right here. Um, from These are from my Instagram and a lot of them include uh, photos from Europe when I went. And I used to have them all back here and it was really pretty and they all fell off. <laughs> Except for this one. Shout out to the boyfriend for this one. My last fact is, um, I would say my dream for the future is to my own boss. Um, I am working, currently working in a nine to five job and I don't particularly hate it. Um, I just hope to have my own company and be my own boss in the future one day. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching my video, 20 facts about me. Um, sorry if this is super long first. Secondly, sorry if the lighting is weird because it's kind of like sunset time, so it might be kind of dark in here now. And yeah, I will leave the link of my blog in the description box below if you want to check it out if you've never seen it before. And if you came from my blog, um, let me know that because I'd love to know if you know, I have some of my readers actually watching this video and wanting to learn more about who I am and my personality. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys next time, later, next blog post. Yeah. <laughs>